just like that. And gets his first point on the board after five to the number two seed to begin the match. Just wants to feel it out of the middle of the strings and settle the nerves down a bit. And he got some hum on that. And that's not going to do yeah, much for his confidence. Definitely. The immediate break of serve. Even by his yeah, lofty standards, that is a pretty impressive opening. Three love three in the blink of an eye after seven minutes. Love well, we talked about that second serve, and you said that he's not going to get much pace out. Have another one. This one's a little tougher. Well done. That is great stuff. Crowd loved that. It just looked like Djokovic was constructing the point exactly the way he wanted it. Nishioka didn't think so. Three big hits of the racket from Novak with his forehand. This one here, that had some flight and some space. Talented shot. That is it. Highly talented shot from there. Use their forehand here. Watch this. Novak just skips to the side, positions himself. Look how low he stays down on the. The quality goes up from here. That's a great shot. Again, Djokovic. Another love game. Novak's lost just the one yeah, point on serve yeah, so far. And look at his control, even with the new balls race. Sometimes you see players Long spray it over the baseline. Nishioka says to Djokovic, if you're going to win it, you're going to have to do it yourself. Nice bit of speed haul here on the ball, 148 kilometers an hour. And he only needs a second yeah. one to get it done inside half an hour comprehensively for Djokovic, hardly getting out of first gear. He takes the first set, 6-3. Before you get to the Aussie Open. Yep. Good wheels. We know he's quick. Plays it so well, Novak, that drop shot. And then just Novak plays this. He moves forward. He covers all the options. So you don't have a lot of space to hit around. Perfect tennis.
I was talking about Pete, his ability to use the lines and that spreads his opponent. And that's a little untidy and he just looks at his box and says, well, I don't know, what, I don't know what more I can do out here. His body language is saying, somebody help me, please. And that's the problem. When you get out there, this is one of those sports where you, you can be out there for an hour and a half, five hours and 53 minutes against Rafael Nadal in that final in 2012, and you're by yourself. You figure it out. Again, you've seen a few. Sorry, you've seen a few. Mr. Djokovic is my miss on the left of the left. Most called in. It was drifting late. It was a relatively clean hit, but. Yeah, they got it. Better, well done. Excellent. A little bit of luck, but he gets yeah, the hold that he was vision. after. Well, this is about as close yeah, to perfection as you can get. Better. Again, that's... Use of the line. And Novak was already walking, yeah. said, I'm not going to bother with that at 40 love. Just oh. easy power, isn't it? That, that's the beauty of Novak when you're watching him. He's got just natural easy power. Every trick in the book, and it's on display today. Please keep, you can't keep playing like this. Look how far behind the baseline he is. What would you possibly expect the outcomes to be most times? And he looks like a man who has resigned to his fate. Disappointing way for that to end, but what a performance this has been from Djokovic. He has been incredible. 45 seconds for the game. It's two sets to love. It was better. Broken to love, completely a broken player out there on the court. I really think you've got to go out there and actually go, you know what, I've got to start enjoying this. I've got to throw caution to the wind here. That's outstanding. This is pure ball striking right here. Right at the apex. Again, the depth, not just that finishing point, but the one before that, it just continually allows Novak to get cheap replies through the middle of the court. What he's doing out here is not easy.
And how about the return of yeah. serve? It's a double break. This is exceptional. Oh. <laughs> and he'll be aware of the number. In the back of his head, he'll oh. know. Nishioka was standing there, and if the ball came at him, he was going to return it. And if it went either side, he wasn't going to do much about it. And now he's taking the mickey a little bit. Fans, it's a good touch. Be a talented tennis player. We just haven't seen, well, he hasn't been given the opportunity. High quality performance. Finally, some resistance, and the crowd is really warming to what he's been able to do over the last 10 minutes or so. Feel just what he's been battling against. That's a good way to answer. 191 kilometres an hour for ace number 17. Great ability to step on Djokovic. Step on the ball, Novak. Perfection is a very hard thing to achieve in sport, but what we've seen today might be as close as you could possibly come.